What is up guys and gals, Space Unicorn here, bringing you some hot frag action. So today, what we are doing is we are going to play the new epic card challenges, this particular one being the Smoker Challenge. We're going to see if we can get these cards, get some dubs for you guys real quick, hopefully not lag everywhere, and maybe give you a couple little tips for any time you face an epic card challenge. So here we go. Give me my opponent. Who is going to be my first victim? Easy from space. Hmm. Is that... Here's the thing, I, from what I have heard, bots don't spawn in these arenas, supposedly. Um, so we'll find out momentarily. If he's lagging, or if I'm lagging, he's definitely real. And he is real. That is surprising. I'm used to people not running that name, because it's kind of weird. Anyways, here's some hot striker gameplay. We're going to get in here, we're going to get lots of kills with the striker. I have not played striker in a long time. I used to really enjoy playing him. Um, and he's just always been fun to me, and he's just a fast, well, fast card with a lot of potential, guys. That's all I can tell you about Striker. We're going to sit here, we're going to pound this tower, guys. So one thing you want to note, anytime you do a challenge series like this, the decks are randomly generated. That means, in theory, you have no clue what you're going to get. However, I have found a little tiny formula that may help you in regards to building, well, not necessarily building, but on how the decks are made. So, you always have at least one legendary card in your lineup. I've never not had one. You will have a common card in your lineup. As you can see in my case, the common card is Snow, of all things. Um, not sure how I feel about that. We got lucky because our fifth card is actually another legendary card. But for the most part, you have a rare and epic a legendary and a common and the fifth card is randomly generated if you look at my lineup right now we got smoker as our epic our defense is Genk Jenkins I think it was I can't remember I haven't seen the <laughs> but you kind of get the idea so the lineups are usually one from each rank with the fifth being a wild card version there he is Fidelio oh so I did not get an, a rare card epic card rare card rare card sorry but normally, I have seem to be noticing a pattern where you're getting at least one legendary, guaranteeing an epic, because this is obviously an epic card event, and usually getting a rare and a common with the fifth being random. So let's hop into another match, and let's see if we can get the job done. Hopefully we can go quick 2-0 and for you guys. This video is kind of a last minute thing. I have a video I'm editing up for the rankings, so this is something I want to do for fun, just to hang out with you guys, give you guys something to watch. Hopefully... This is an enjoyable video. Whoa, look at that ping. Let's uh, let's try a queue up again. What do you guys think? <laughs> um, oh, connecting. That, that's lovely. Uh, can I play now, please? Thank you. Thank you, Frag, for letting me play the game that I have spent so much time on in so many hours. You're wonderful. <laughs> Alrighty, guys. So let's get them. We are facing Karateka. Is that right? Karateka? We have Mr. Tiger, Quetzal, Vlad. Okay, here we go. We're gonna start Mr. Tiger. I have not put Mr. Tiger in a long. Mr. Tiger is a lot of fun, guys. He's very similar to Mecha Knight in the fact the way his weapon shoots. He is a hit scan. He does do actually pretty solid damage, but he's a big target and he's very very slow. So you have to remember that anytime you are running this character, just. Uh, don't leave yourself in the open too much against real player, you know what I mean? Because it doesn't take much to hit the tiger. Get the bunny. Haha, <laughs> let's call him the ultimate. Barrage. I want to put it right there on that yellow dot, please. I do really love his ult. I think it's so much fun. It's a little tricky sometimes to place it correctly. Imagine if this guy had Soldier Tron's AI accuracy, because his ult is actually faster than Soldier Tron's. Ooh, it would be scary if he had Soldier Tron accuracy. Oh, man, that'd be scary. I'm just si Oh, it gives you shivers, man. It gives you shivers. Let's get this little tower out of the way. And let's head up top over to the next one. Hey, uh, Karateka, I'm up here. Shoot me. He should be killing me at any minute, hopefully. And there we go. Looks like I lag died. That's that's lovely, because that's, that's the way everybody likes to die. <laughs> let's grab Quetzal. So, guys... This, this is a fun challenge. If you guys have not participated in these challenges, I would strongly recommend doing it. It's a good chance to earn a lot of gold and lots of different rewards that you'll find yourself needing as you start to level up in this game. Um, if you are low level, these events honestly should be a must for you. They'll give you cards that 
you haven't had the chance to play with, get a feel for, and experience. It's also going to give you the chance to play people on an even playing field. That's something I really love. I love the fact that all the cards in these events are level 9, and that just makes it super, super enjoyable for me. Um, for those of you guys who don't know, if you guys have never played a tournament, always in tournaments your cards are level 9. They're not ever what you bring to the party. So it's it's something to kind of keep in mind, just kind of enjoying enjoy the fairness of it. Like Honestly, the, get, the decks can be a little lopsided sometimes, um, but you really do have the ability to just enjoy playing on equal footing with somebody else in these events. Um, yeah, anyways, we're back on Mr. Tiger here. We're going to push up here and see if we can sneak him into position here to do some work. Ugh. <laughs> I'm doing something very disgusting with my aim, if you guys can't tell. Uh, I'm actually aiming high because I played Polka earlier today. <laughs> so I'm aiming high because of it. <laughs> I shouldn't be doing that, I'm afraid. Oh no, lag spike, lag spike, lag spike. No, go away. No! How did he get me? I was lagging everywhere. Oh no. That's sad. That's sad right there, guys. Let's grab Quetzal again. Uh, why are you staring at him? I want you to go this way. There's a tower over here with your name on it, Quetzal. That's right, your name. Just sneak over here, you know, tiptoe, tiptoe, tiptoe. Up here and kabam. There goes the tower. So guys, I think I'm going to end this, win this game here, and I think that'll be the end of the video for the day. Um, I hope you guys enjoy this, and I hope you guys have a lot of fun with these events. I know I do. So remember, guys, stay safe, like, comment, subscribe in the down there, and I will see you legends in the next one. Have a fantastic day, everybody. Bye-bye.